Welcome to MLB The Show in this presentation of Minor League Baseball. Opening night here in this brand new season between the Akron Rubber Ducks and the Binghamton Rumble Ponies. Stepping into the box, Aaron Bracho, and we are set for baseball here this evening. Lifted in the air out towards left center. Center fielder on the run. That's a hit, their first of the new season. And he's going to get to second now with nobody out. The right fielder, number seven, Alex Paul. Stepping in now, Alex Call. Lays off the slider that time, two and one. He breaks out the hook there. Good for strike two. Hey, I love that pitch right there. Better execution after just giving up an extra base hit. Swing and a liner. But right there to glove it is the shortstop for the first out. Now at the plate, Tyler Freeman. As he'll get his first opportunity in this one. Tyler Freeman. a fastball not close as he runs it to two and one now at the knees for a called strike and it's back to even at two and two probably better that he let that pitch go anyway after seeing a lively fastball in the pitch before it's pretty hard to sit back enough on a well thrown changeup. Pascal will range to his left and put it away two down and no tag at second he'll head back there with two away now the catcher. Settling in now, Bo Naylor. Great chance to drive in a run here in the early going. Here's the one-two. Fouled off. From the stretch, the one-two. Yanked high and deep down the line in right. And it's a foul ball. One and two. Here it is. Rolled slowly down the third baseline. Waved at and missed for the third out. Not much of a chance at hitting that one, and the inning is over. So coming to the plate, Jacob Zanon. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Now the three and two pitch. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Longo is there and he has it for the out. Digging in now, Luis Carpio. He'll get to take his first cuts here. Carpio. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Call is over to his right as he puts this one away. Two down. Digging in, Michael Pius looking to get on base and keep this first inning alive. The 1-1. One, one. This one's flared off to the right side. And a dive, but it rattles in and out of the glove. He'll get it into second. The tag, and they'll get him at second. And with that, the side is retired. At the plate, Wilson Garcia. A ball and two strikes now. Threw that fastball right by him. He had no chance to get the barrel to that one. And a changeup swung on and missed for the first down. At the plate, Mitch That's Longo. The left viewer, Mitch Longo. And this ball runs away for ball two. Two and one. in there two and two no score here as we play inning number two fouled away a 
swing and a miss for route number two and a ball he had no chance of making contact with. Stepping in, Alexis Pantoja. First two men in the inning have both gone down via the punch out, so we'll see if he can fare any better. Uh, had him off stride that time, and it's one and two. And a great inning here as he gets another punch out and strikes out the side in order. So now it'll be the four hole hitter, Brent Beatty. He's set to lead off the home half of the second. Line to the right side. And that finds some outfield grass. It's a base hit. So the leadoff man reaches base to start out their half of the second inning. To the plate now, Cody Bohannon. Fastball just inside. He got him to go down after that one, and it's two and two. Hey, I love the mindset of this pitcher right here. Try and dominate and execute a fastball in. And then get the guy sitting inside trying to be quick to everything and then pull the string a little bit on a nasty changeup. Now the three and two pitch. Swing and a miss as he ran the fastball right by him for the first down. Riding in, David Rodriguez. First swings for him in this one with a runner still at first and one gone. Swing and a miss on the fastball that time, out number two. So striding forward now, Quinn Brody. He takes his first cuts in this one with a man at first and two away. The one two. Swing and a miss at a big breaking ball, and that's how the inning comes to an end. Striding forward now is the DH, Legion Chu, as we are all set to begin the third inning in this one. The 1 1 home. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Long run for the right fielder. He gets to it and makes the catch for the first down. Stepping up to the plate, Kai Tom. The center fielder, Kai Tom. The one-two. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Here comes the right fielder. He's got it. A nice play there. Two away. Now, now to the plate, Aaron Bracho. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at bat with another big hit right here. And that's been their only hit so far in this one. They've been dealing with some really great pitching in this game. Count moves to a ball and two strikes now. Popped up. Hayes in foul ground, and the inning is over. Into the box now, Austin Bosar. As we move on to the bottom of inning number three. And now a fastball, but he's able to hold off on it, and it's two and one now. And that pitch comes over to catch the corner. It's two and two now. in the air into shallow left center left fielder coming on he gets there and makes the play for the first down coming to the plate now Peter Pascal from the windup the 1 1 pitch this is hit high in the air out toward left center center fielder on the run he makes the play. Really had to hustle to get to that one. Two gone now. Digging in, Jacob Zana. It was a flyout for him to start the home first. 
Now the one and one pitch. Fly ball out toward left center field. Longo is under it and he makes the catch for out number three. Now at the plate, Alex Call comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. This game is rolling right along as we move into the middle innings with no score. You'd think by now one of these two teams would be able to get some base runners on to get him in, but that hasn't been the case. A bouncer up the middle. And that'll get on by into center field for a leadoff single. The bat, number two. Short Tyler. At the plate now, Tyler Freeman, hard hit at third. He's got it, and the throw to first is in time, one gun. So stepping in, Bo Naylor. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Yeah, he's got to put that one behind him, especially with runners in scoring position. Those punch outs will stick with you a little longer. And he lays off a pitch outside as they draw even at two and two. Not where he wanted that fastball to be, and it's three and two now. No pitcher likes to take the count to three and two, especially when you throw a non-competitive pitch like that on two and two. That one wasn't even close. Another payoff pitch. This is skied into the air to straightaway center. Pascal is there, two gone. Digging in to try it again. Wilson Garcia looking to put the ball in play here. He went down on strikes in his first at bat. Into center field, line drive base hit. And they're going to take a 1 0 lead as the run comes across to score. Now back, left field. Into the box now, Mitch Longo. And he lays off for a ball, two and one. All even now, two and two. Popped him up. And he will indeed make the play in foul territory to retire the side. Into the box now, Luis Carpio. He's 0 for 1 thus far. The 1 2. Still a ball and two strikes. And it's fouled away. And it misses 2 and 2. Tough to take a pitch like that right there, especially in a one-two count. You almost get in that auto swing mode. Great job to work the count back to even. Fastball swung on and missed for the first down. Digging in, Michael Pius. He was cut down at second, attempting to stretch a base hit his first time through. Yeah, Matty, his wheels got him in trouble a little bit last time. Tried to take advantage, thought the defense was napping a little bit. In retrospect, maybe he should have just shut it down and steal second base. Rounded weakly down the line toward third. But this will be a foul ball as that evens things at two and two. Hit on the ground is short. A diving effort here as he gets a glove on it. And he'll make it to first easily on what will almost certainly be ruled an infield single. A designated hitter, number five. Into the box, Britt Beatty. Ground ball sent back up the middle, and that is through into center field. A base hit. The batter number nine, Cody. In now, Cody Bohannon. Looked like the fastball got away from him there. It's ball two. 
great chance right here as a hitter to be really aggressive. With two guys already on, pretty good shot. He's going to get a challenge pitch right here. Ground ball to second. This could be two. To second for one. And the relay won't nearly be in time as he's there easily. Ready for another chance? David Rodriguez. As he's got a chance to tie this ball game up with that equalizing run just 90 feet away at third. Comes with the fastball, but it's outside for ball four. Standing in now with runners in scoring position, Quinn Brody. And he'll be tasked with bringing home the potential tying and go ahead runs, both of which are standing in scoring position. And he just misses inside with the fastball there. It often becomes harder to hit the zone when the pressure starts to heat up. The 2 1 pitch. Oh, and this could be trouble now. It's three and one. You fight so hard to get into these type of counts. You can't let this pitch get away from you. You have to keyhole something middle of the plate. On to second for the force out, and the side is retired. All set for the start of the inning. Bigging in for his second at bat, Alexis Pantoja. He was a strikeout victim in his first try. Maybe too much break on the slider. Two and one. Oh, not cheated on that one. It's two and two. Not where he wanted that fastball to be, and it's three and two now. Turned on down the line. But this will get foul, so they'll do it again. Three and two. And he fouls this one off. Another full count pitch home. And a good eye here as he takes ball four, and it's a base on balls to lead off the fifth inning. Now Pat, designated. The plate now is the designated hitter, Lee Jin Chu. Flied out in his first at bat, so make him 0 for 1 so far. On its tailor made to short, six, four, three, and they turn the double play. So base is empty now after the double play. And standing in the outfielder, Kai Tom. Just got the corner that time with a fastball. Strike two. And a slider called strike three as he couldn't pull the trigger, and the side is retired. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. Coming to the plate now, Austin Bosar. He flew out in his last at bat. Two and two. Line to shortstop, and there's one away. Standing in, Peter Pasco. So far, 0 for 1 with a flyout. To short. Fielded cleanly. Throw in the dirt to first, and he can't come up with it cleanly. So it's a runner at first as a result of the throwing error. And next, it'll be the outfielder, Jacob Zanin. Here comes the payoff pitch. Liner toward right center. And that'll split the gap as it should be extra bases. And they'll have runners at second and third following the one out double. Stepping in now, Luis Carpio. Line drive base hit into the left center field gap. They're not going to get him. He's in there at the plate. The third baseman, Kevin Michael. So now to the plate, Michael oh, yeah. Pires. Now this is slowly hit to short, probably too slowly to get to. And an off-balance throw is in time as he takes one away. Wow. 
Ready for another shot now. Brett Beatty, he singled his last time up. Yeah, and they take another single right here. That third base coach is dying to wave his arms. I wouldn't be surprised if anything hit hard through the infield. He's going to wave them. Two balls and two strikes now. Looking to keep this a one run game, the pitch. For the guy on the mound, this is one of those innings where nothing comes easy. He's thrown a bunch of pitches, and this AB hasn't been any different. Definitely laboring at the moment. This is pulled into right. He leaps, but he can't get it. It's down for extra bases. He pulls into second safely as a run will score on the play as well. Now back. Standing in now, Cody Bohannon. Softly on a line to third. Leaps and makes a terrific catch. And with that, the side is retired. New inning set to get underway. So the lineup flips over and digging in. Aaron Bracho in his last at bat, he popped out in foul ground. Yeah, Matt, he's got to make an adjustment right here. His swing definitely broke down, dropped his back shoulder, and thus the result was a terrible pop-up foul. The one-two. Misses for the second ball. Don't be surprised if he gets another back foot slider right here. Don't think for a second, just because he took the first one, that this pitcher won't come back exactly the same way. Won't commit on the slider. Good patience, and it's full three and two. And in a two-run game right here, you really don't want to walk the leadoff guy to start an inning. You've got to keep that tying run in the on-deck circle as long as you can. And he'll stay with it here as he puts the squeeze on it for route number one. Now in the box, Alex Call. He scored after reaching on a single in his last time up. Here now the 2-2. Two -two. Is a wave and a miss. He struck him out. So striding in, Tyler Freeman. He comes in 0 for 2 thus far. Tyler. The 1 1 home. He's looked at for ball number two. Man, this guy's had their number all game long. Up, down, in and out. He's pitching very well. Takes this the other way to right. And that's in for a base hit. Make it a 1 for 3 game so far. So we'll go at least one at bat deeper into the top of the sixth after that two out success. Into the box now. Bo Naylor. Skied in the air to straightaway left. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away, and that ends the inning. Now at the plate, David Rodriguez. It was a walk in his last trip. One and two now as that one's fouled off. Now here it comes. Pulled high in the air out to left field. Longo is there and he'll bring this one in. Ready once again, Quinn Brody, 0 for 2 on his line thus far. We're in the sixth inning here in a 3 to 1 ball game. Not close with the off speed pitch taken for a ball. Keep in mind, people, the longer the at bat, the higher the likelihood that this becomes his last inning. Reined in. Throw in time at first for out number two. Stepping in, Austin Bosar. He started out the evening 0 for 2 so far. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. Hit out towards second. Oh, look at the sliding stop. He gathers the throw. Got him. In now, Wilson Garcia. He came through with an RBI single in his last at-bat. Even though we're moving into the back end of this game, they're only down by a couple of runs. You know that old slogan, a boop and a blast? They could certainly use that right now. 
a little too tall that time. Three and one now. Hey, leading off an inning in this situation, three balls on you. You have to know that a solo shot's not tying this game up. You have to find a way to get on base any way possible. Brody moves to his right and puts this one away in the alley for at number one. At now the plate, back. Mitch Longo. He is 0 for 2 with a strikeout in this one. Longo. Way outside, nearly to the backstop, 2 and 1. Big sweeping breaking ball right there. Good pitch, but if he wants to get him to swing at it, he'll have to bring it in a little bit closer to the strike zone. The 2 2. Every base runner in a close game like this really matters, so you can't afford to be giving out free passes this late. And a swing and a miss here, so it's a quick two outs to start the seventh. Riding in once again, Alexis Pantoja. It was a walk in his last trip. Called strike two as he locks him up there. Great pitch right there. That is a huge breaking ball. Not shocked he took it. Got to calibrate that one for a second. Well hit the other way again. It's into the gap. Running hard. He's digging for second. This will kick up against the wall now. And he is in the second with a two-out double. Andrew Church is out from the bullpen as he'll get his first work of the season here on opening night. Your attention, please. Now, number 45. Into the box, Lee Jin Chu. Taken off the outside as the breaking ball couldn't catch the corner. Watching him on the mound right now, I think he's just having trouble throwing strikes to this guy. Up only two runs, I don't think he's working around him. Three and one to him now. So look now the pitch. We're in the seventh inning with a good finish brewing. Three to one our score. Slap hard the opposite way. And that's in there. Base hit. And the runner at third will put the brakes on here as they didn't want to chance it even with two outs. Now batting. The cover field. At yeah, the uh, plate, Kai Tom. Tom. Sliced hard on the ground. And he will deliver one of the biggest at-bats of the night. It's a base hit in the score, the runner from third. Now back second base. Aaron. In now, Aaron Bracho fouled off. Big spot. Two out, possible tying and go-ahead runs on base. And a full count as that misses. It's three and two now. Alex Call would be next. Hit out towards second. He's got it. Throw to first in time. And the big inning is avoided as the side is retired. Cam Hill gets the call from the pen to take over on the mound and start the home seventh. Into the box. Peter Pascoe. He's 0 for 2 thus far in this one. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. And he misses low here, so the count goes to three and one. And just when you needed a shutdown inning, a leadoff walk was certainly not on the agenda. He needs a bear down right here. Uh, no leadoff walk just yet as that finds the strike zone and the count comes full at three and two. Let's him off the hook there as this isn't even close for ball four. So the batting order turns over now and set to go. Jacob Zanin who came across to score after doubling in his last at bat. Well he got a good pitch to hit last time up. Looked for it up in the zone and didn't miss it. Those are the pitches you only get maybe once an A.B. Maybe once a game. Maybe once a week. So he certainly capitalized on it last time. Swing and a miss there as the breaking ball takes care of him for the first out. Now back. Digging in and looking for more, Luis Carpio. He singled and drove home two his last time. Sent in the air out to straightaway center. Tom is there to put it away, and the runner will be forced to retreat back to first. 
Stepping into the box, Michael Pius. He's two for three thus far. Very tight ball game. Three to two our score in inning number seven. Lifted down the line in left. And that's going to land foul. Another 1-2 delivery. Lays off 2-2 two and two now. And he missed with it here, so now it's a full count, 3-2. and two. Good running count right here. Three balls, two strikes, two outs, run run first. He'll be off to the races on this pitch. Swing hard liner to left center. Again, a nice clean base hit. His third of the game. The relay. The tag, and they'll get him at second. And with that, the side is retired. Stepping in now, Alex Call. That nibbled the corner there, but missed two and one. And it's two balls and two strikes now. Here now the 2-2. It's laid off and the count runs full. Fouled away. The next 3-2. Freezes him. A strikeout looking. Ready now, Tyler Freeman. It was a single for him in his last at-bat. Tyler Freeman. Fly ball out to straightaway right. Brody is over just a few steps to his left as he takes it for out number two. So here's the cleanup hitter, Bo Naylor. No thump out of him in this game so far as might be expected. He's 0 for 3. Goes the other way, and this is in the air out to left. Zanin will reach out with one hand to make the catch on the move, and that ends the inning. Trying to pick things up where we left off. Brett Beatty trying to keep it going. A perfect three for three thus far. And it's one and two. One and two. Hit sharply on the ground. Scooped up. And there's one away. Now batting Cody Bohannon. He's hitless in three at bats to this point. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. This one, everything we could have hoped for, three to two in inning number eight. And it's fouled away. The 2 2 pitch. Shin high. That's taken for a ball. Boy, really making him work now as the seventh pitch of the at bat is also fouled away. So the count will hold steady at three balls and two strikes. Neither guy given in. Here's the next one. Sent out to straightaway center field. Tom is there now and he has it two gone at the plate David now Rodriguez that's it that's was a fly out for him in his last trip Rodriguez. and now pitch on the way I changed things up on him and he got him to swing through it one and two now. Swing and a miss at one in the dirt. And the throw to first ends the inning. Joseph Shaw comes out of the bullpen to shut things down here in the ninth. Number 30. 
All set to start the ninth in this one. Digging in the switch hitter, Wilson Garcia. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. Now a changeup locks him up as he looks at strike three called. One away. Digging in once again, Mitch Longo. He could really use a knock here. 0 for 3 in the game so far. And he'll lay off the curveball that's in the dirt that time, and it's back to even now at 2 and 2. He struck him out the third time he's fanned in the game. Stepping up now, Alexis Pantoja. He doubled earlier in the game, 1 for 2 to this point. And this one's up around the eyes, two and one. Two and one. Taken called strike two, and now they're down to their final strike tonight. Hey, it looks like this guy's going to work in the upper part of this. Swing and a miss. He struck him out, and that'll do it here as the ball game is over. And a nice job here to come in and slam the door. That's his first save of the season, but it certainly won't be his last. Three to two, the finish in tonight's game. Binghamton used a nice fifth inning to take the lead, and they never gave it back. David Peterson gets the win on the mound, his first of the year. Tanner Tully is saddled with a loss after giving up only one earn. Joseph Shaw hammers down the save, his first of the year. So that's a wrap here tonight. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, this is Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, find us on Twitter, at MLB The Show.